I'm back. I'm back. I'm back. Uh, I'm back. I'm back. I'm 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 in my gold chain, rip it, rip it, my God. Rocket pumps and J's, rip it, rip it, my God. Fresh new swag, rip it, rip it, my God. Who said I couldn't be fly? Rip it, rip it, my God. Welcome back to my channel guys. Welcome back to Unique Individuals channel and thank you so much for your positive feedback, your positive comments, your likes. Thank you for subscribing. Just thank you guys. It's been so much fun and I've enjoyed doing it. And now I've enjoyed it so much, I'm gonna do another one. So here we go. I think this is another crazy story. I feel like I've had so many crazy moments in my life and I just really am baffled about how I actually experienced them. This is another one. This is another crazy one. So, yet again, I'm super young. So probably about 11 years old. And I think it was like um, the end of all disco. So remember discos, it wasn't even called raving, it was called discos. And I was uh, in primary school. And, oh, sorry mum, I'm just about to tell the truth on here. But maybe I should have told you first before I did this video, but here it goes. <sighs> One of my friends had bought, purchased uh, a boob tube. She just comes across here and it's probably right there on the screen. Um, and she had given it to me. And what's really funny is probably one of them will be watching this and probably end up watching this one day. So, bought me a boob tube and I was like, oh my gosh, like I need to wear this. And my mum was super conservative. And to be honest, if I had an 11 year old child and she told me she wanted to wear a boob tube to a disco, I'd be like, hell no. But when I was younger, I was like, why is she not letting me wear it? And she's like, I don't think she even knew about it, to be honest. She didn't even know about the boob tube. But anyway, so what I did was, and I'm sure many of you guys have done this before, the outfit that I did wear, I snuck the boob tube underneath it. So when I go to the, you know, the disco, I can start flexing my chest. <laughs> start acting you know like oh my gosh everyone look at me I'm wearing the boob tube uh, so anyway as I'm there I'm dancing with my friends I've taken my actual jumper off I think I wore like a jumper top it was really nice I think it came across here and it kind of hung off my shoulders but it was really nice and um, took it off and I thought do you know what I am gonna be like the fashionista of this disco I've got my boob tube on Come on, man, no one can test me. Like, I'm just super cool right now. Girl, no. So I was dancing with it, showing it off. Everyone's like, oh my God, what is that? It's really nice. I was like, where'd you get that? And I was like, top shop, you know, just acting all like extra as per usual. So I think we got had a toilet break. And as you know, you know us girls, we like going to the toilets together. We went as a team <laughs> to the toilet. And um, one of the girls that I went with, um, she was like my bestie in school so we even had like necklaces and everything that said like best friend and I had the best and she had the friend and um it was her sister that came with us to the toilet as well so it's me her her sister and someone else I think two other girls so we're in the toilet talking I think reapplying our lip glosses you know our, lit our glitter lip glosses from like Claire's accessories or whatever just as we were talking I have no idea what possessed the girl no idea. See, there is devil I'm telling you, I have no idea what possessed this girl. As we're standing there talking, she, well, the girl is my best friend's sister, younger sister. So she felt the need to, I have no idea why, I don't know whether they thought it was funny, well, she must have thought it was funny. The girl hold my top down. All they probably saw was just chocolate buttons. <laughs> she literally just... Not that there was anything to see, to be honest. I was 11 and there was nothing there. And there still is nothing there. But anyway, the point is, I was like, no. Why would you do that? I was so vexed. Ah, I just thought, she's so lucky. I am, um, she, like, she, I had to relax. 
I had to chill. I had to be like, do you know what? Not tonight. Just not tonight. I had to call in Jesus and I had to be like, Lord, give me strength for this moment. The way I felt like... <laughs> I just wanted to like go wild. But do you know what? I don't know what it is. I think I was, the shock just kind of, I just couldn't believe it happened. I was just like, but that's not the point. The point is violation. It was complete violation. I don't know what made her do it. Why? Was she curious to see what chocolate buttons look like? Like, I'm confused. <laughs> it will it, it will never leave my mind like I will never forget this story it will be passed on to generations and generations a story for the grandkids but it was crazy I think like the next day or the day after she apologised her sister apologised on her behalf and stuff like that but it was a wild story and she's lucky she got away with it like Scott Freak I don't think I even did anything to be honest because I was so stunned and so shocked Yeah. And then in my head, I just could hear mom going, Good for you. Good for you. That's what happens when you lie. That's what happens when you sneak out, you become sneaky. That's what happens. Karma just comes for you. So I literally was like, I can't, I couldn't even tell anyone. So, of course, that's another story for you guys. <laughs> The moral of the story is to really listen to your parents. <laughs> you can avoid these kind of mistakes. Just don't wear anything that they tell you not to wear, Just, please. And of course, guys, so be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And always remember to stay blessed. I'm, I'm, I'm in my gold chain, rip it, rip it, my God. Rocket pops and J's, rip it, rip it, my God. Fresh new swag, rip it, rip it, my God. Who said I couldn't be fly? Rip it, rip it, my God.